Hello, Gemini. This will be your love reading. And we're going to do things a little different. We're going to take a look at your energy. We're going to take a look at your person's energy. And then we're going to take a look at your connection. And we're going to see how your person is really feeling about you. You know, what's going on with this connection? So let me know if you like this spread in the comment section. Let me know if this is something that you want to see again. Okay, Gemini. What energy is coming out for Gemini? Okay, we have... Write down your goals and your dreams. Dream big. What energies are coming out for Gemini for this love connection? Re rejection. Oh my goodness. Okay, what's going on here, Gemini? And what are your person's energies? What energies are your person's energies? We have get creative and excite your imagination with wonder. Cool. It's way too many cards. Let's get some cards. What's the energy of this person, spirit? What is this person's energy? Self worth. At the bottom, we have confusion. Okay, so I feel like there's a lot of confusion in this situation. And I feel like things are going on. You have aspirations on where you feel like you want this relationship to go. But I feel like you're you're feeling sort of rejected in the situation. You feel like you're not appreciated. Like, they just don't see everything that you're doing, everything that you're trying to accomplish. You kind of feel kind of held back in a sense. And I feel like this person is fighting for your attention, Gemini, uh, because I feel like, you know, they're excited about this situation, but I feel like they don't feel like you see them as worthy in the situation. You don't see them as equal. That's the word that I'm getting. They don't feel equal in this relationship. They feel like their self-worth is a little tilted. Is what I'm feeling. So, yeah. Okay. Let's get some more energy. Let's take a look at the tarot. We're going to first take a look at your energy, Gemini. And then we'll take a look at your persons. So, spirits. Give me a message for Gemini. What is Gemini? What's going on with Gemini with this love connection? The Queen of Wands. So you may be very passionate. I feel like you're very loving, very caring. You're very outgoing. You're very flirty is what I'm getting, Gemini. But I feel like you're kind of out to get what you want. And if you feel like you're being rejected, you kind of feel like, okay, it's time for me to move on to something different. Because this person is rejecting me, so, I mean, I don't think they're worth my time. That's kind of the energy that I'm feeling. The, the Queen of Wands, she's a go-getter. She's out to get exactly what she wants. She's very confident, very assertive very bold and sexual. The Queen of Wands is very attractive. She holds her beauty very close to her, you know? So I feel like in some aspects, you may be a little vain, um, Gemini. You may want your hair in the exact place it needs to be, or, you know, you want your makeup just right if you're a female. Um, you may want to be dressed just right, you know. Um, but yeah, I feel like you hold your appearance.
close to your confidence, if that makes sense. Yeah, we have the hangman. So you're not quite sure, Gemini. You're not quite so sure. You're soul searching. You're looking for in, inner wisdom in this situation. You have the nine of cups on the bottom. So I feel like this is a relationship that you want. This is something that you really want to put your energy into. Yeah, we have the justice card that popped out. You're looking for someone who balances you. Someone who gives you the same attention, the same... The same caring, nurturing that you give. And if you feel like you're not getting that, you're like ready to move, ready to run, ready to, you know, put your walls up and just explore other options. Um, but I feel like you're very anxious about the situation. You really want this situation to work, but I feel like, Gemini, you want it to work on your terms. You may need to see the other person's perspective, the other person's point of view. Um, step inside this other person's shoes for a moment and take a look at the situation from their eyes. You know? What is this energy of this person? in this love connection. Give me the energy for this other person. The Page of Swords. Yeah, I feel like this person is very curious. They want to speak truth to you. They want to let you know how they feel, how you make them feel. <clears throat> and I feel like in some aspects, Gemini, you kind of make them feel kind of inadequate. And I'm just being honest with you. Please. <laughs> Don't kill the messenger. I'm being honest with you. But this person is very curious. I feel like this person really wants to speak their truth. <laughs> Definitely. They have the magician energy as well. This person really wants to speak their truth. They want... To put their focus on this situation. They want this situation to grow. And to expand into something greater than it already is. I feel like this person's feelings for you are very strong. But they're trying to get past this feeling of inadequacy. They're trying to get past this feeling of. How, you know, they feel. Let's get some more energy for this person. <clears throat> the star card. Yeah, so this person is healing. They're going through some kind of healing period. They may be healing from a situation that they were in before. But I feel like this person has a lot of hope that this situation is going to get better. They have a lot of hope that you're going to see them for exactly who they are. Um... They just want a new beginning with this. They want to start over. Yeah, we have the King of Cups at the bottom. So definitely they want to start over. They, they want to build this love into something that is more nurturing for the both of you. Something that... will bring you both the same benefits, the same rewards. Tell me about this connection, Spirit. Tell me more about this connection. The Five of Cups. For them, the Five of Wands. Okay, Gemini. So, you want to let this situation go. You're ready to walk away and leave what it is behind. Your person wants to fight. They want to fight for this relationship. You have two fives next to each other. So that is progress, success. 
you know, but it's also struggle. So I feel like this person is ready to fight for this situation. Um, and I feel like you just may be ready to let it go. And you have the moon. For your person, they have the devil. So yeah, I feel like, you know, you're on this journey. You're on this path. You're seeing these unforeseen changes that are happening and your person is being blocked your your person is feeling binded or they feel like there's a big struggle like they're envious of what's going on with you you know okay for you I feel like you can move past this though because you have the the King of Cups. The King of Cups already came out in this situation as well. So I feel like this is just a bump in the road. You're going to get past this and you're going to move into something much more better. And your person is actually going to feel more grounded. That They're looking for this new beginning. And I feel like this new beginning is going to be happening very soon. Um, you also have the Ace of Pentacles on the bottom. So definitely some kind of new beginning, some kind of new realization is coming through in this situation that's going to bring more love, more, more resolution to the situation. Give me a card. Give me a love card for you. A separation. Yeah, you're ready to move on. You're ready to see things in a different light. We have sadness, missing you, thinking about you, yearning, unsure of the future. So that's your energy. Now, what is your person's energy? Your person's energy is the clock. They need time. Take time. End time. Cycles time to heal progress yeah so your person thinks that things will get better in time things will work out things will work themselves out um but you're thinking about separation so hmm but your person wants to stick it out they want to see where this goes they want to see where this goes you know Let's see. I'm going to get some more love cards for this connection. Well, you know what? Let's get these first. Okay. Tell me about this person, spirit. Tell me about this person in Gemini's life, this love connection. Tell me what they're feeling, what their inner thoughts are. They want to put their focus on you. They're ready to fight for you. They're ready to focus on you. Put you first. Even though they feel like you may not be putting them first. They're ready to put you first. And they feel like someone is being sneaky. Someone may be telling you things that are is changing your mind about this person. They feel like someone is like a third party in the situation that's kind of in your ear telling you things that is making them feel inadequate and making you jealous okay this person hmm I feel like this person may be feeling inadequate so they're like making you jealous to see how much you care making you jealous to see if you're willing to fight for them like they're willing to fight for you. They're kind of testing you, Gemini. They're putting you through a test to see how deep your feelings really are. Yeah, we have new beginning. A new adventure awaits. Embrace it and live your dreams passionately. So you may be looking for a new beginning as well. I feel like you may want to start over with this person. 
you may want to start over and you know make this new for your person we have give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way know that you deserve to be and have all that your heart truly desires yeah they're really fighting with feeling adequate that goes back to that self-worth they may have a low self-esteem they may not be very confident about themselves or what their abilities are what is give me a card for this connection spirit where is this connection going time you are trying too hard give it time so yeah that is your advice from spirit give it time give it time to grow time to endure you know uh, time to learn each other okay we're gonna look at another deck and we're gonna see what the outcome is for the situation what is the outcome for the situation the king of swords so I feel like a lot of truth is going to be revealed a lot of truth is going to be revealed and this is going to take you into a your thoughts and for them we have the strength for this connection we have the king of cups okay so yeah I truly feel like this this love this love is here you care about this person and this person cares about you but I feel like there's a lot going on there may be people around you who are feeding you information that may be accurate but it may be wrong and I feel like this person sees it as sneaky. They see it as an opportunity to make you jealous because they feel like you don't see them as worthy of being with you. And that leaves you feeling rejected. You know, but this person, I feel like a lot of a lot of truth. You're gonna speak your truth, Gemini. You're gonna tell them exactly how you feel, exactly how you know everything is working and this person is going to be strong they're going to gain the self-worth that they need the strength is all about self-love it's all about unconditional love self-respect courage to get through any situation you know and i feel like that's what this person is lacking that's what this person needs to learn to grow into is this self-love this admiration for yourself and I feel like with confidence on your part and focusing on each other instead of just walking away from the situation or creating more unseen problems, unseen, you know, challenges. I feel like you're going to come together with this King of Cups. You're going to come together and you're going to grow. You're going to feel the support that this person wants to give you you're going to feel at ease in the situation you know that is the outcome of this connection but it's going to take time it's not something that's going to happen overnight you and this person need to work on the situation you need to work on your communication on being able to speak your truth speak how you feel and kind of work through whatever issues you need to work through because this person will fight for you this person is not walking away they're they're standing there and they're fighting okay Gemini this is what I have for you and please in the comment section please let me know if you like this spread if you want to see it again and um, Until the next reading, Gemini, many blessings to you, love and light.